Okay, so for our videos, we like to use this like kind of a, not a selfie stick, but just like a, a handle. It, when your fist is like this, you can hold the camera a lot more stable than holding cameras like this. And we've been looking for it nonstop for like like three or four days. And then Joe's like, you know, I think the last time I had it was on the dock when you came back from town. Alyssa and I flew home. He videoed a little bit of it. He's like, and I, and I think Bonnie grabbed it. Or it might have rolled into the lake. I was like, I'll go check. So I found it. Check this out. We're out on the dock now. He's like, uh, back right corner, somewhere over here. You see that? That. Ah, uh, it's deep. That is not organic material. All right. Back to holding the camera the right way. Joe is off on a hike. Bonnie's in the kitchen doing uh, dinner prep already. And it's not even noon. She's always in the kitchen doing dinner prep with Alyssa. But on this occasion, Alyssa is in town with the two girls. They had to do a dentist appointment and a couple other things like that. So I am the groundskeeper today. I've got a couple projects I gotta do. A small propane leak in one of the cabins. So that's not safe. Uh, we gotta get that fixed. It's under the cabin and you can smell it when you're in the cabin. That's one of my projects. My next project is mowing the lawn and finalizing the cabins. We've got guests in the cabins uh, now. Joe's out hiking with them and we're prepping as much as possible because right as soon as they leave tomorrow, we've got six more guests coming in tomorrow morning. So cabin changeover is something that has to be done very fast. So yeah, that's about it. All right, we are in front of cabin three. Got my tools. I'll show you what I gotta do here. Got a couple crescent wrenches and some fittings propane pipe fittings we got to take an old piece of of copper pipe that goes to an old propane lantern we're just getting rid of that it's old it has a tiny little uh, crack in it from a crease that happened and uh, we no longer use the propane lanterns when everything has gone to solar lanterns and stuff like that so it's a lot more efficient plus we don't need this we go through less propane so we're just gonna cap it. There's no reason to like pull it out of the wall, make the mess bigger. I'm gonna go in there in about an hour and make sure that I, I don't smell anything. Let's do it. Okay, so I've shut off the propane bottle and then I just went into the cabin, turned on the heater and watched the pilot light slowly die. So I think I'm good. Okay, so that was easy enough. Little crescent wrench action. Put the pipe fittings where I needed them, done deal. So I gotta come back, check and uh, see if that odor is gone underneath the cabin. That's about it. I just wasted 10 seconds of your life. So it's been about two hours since I shut off that uh, propane. Here is the guest cabin in question. You smell that? I, uh, I don't smell anything so much better. I don't think we have a problem anymore. Mmm, mission accomplished. I think my projects are done for the day. I better go see what else I can do to help. All right, guys. The Monte Brothers. <laughs>